I don't even know what to say, boys. I got 14 day ban on Madden. My whole Wheel of Mutt squad, my 4 million coins, everything that I needed to complete Wheel of Mutt before, before I don't play Madden in all of June and July. And today is May 16th, right? And they banned me for 14 days. And I promise you guys that I would not be posting Madden all of June, July. Meaning, I'm banned right up until June and July. You would think EA would want to support their largest Madden content creator. And yes, that's a humble brag, but it's facts. But they continuously shit on me, and, and granted I shit on them. But they really cucked me this time. I, I, is this it, boys? Is this the end of Wheel of Mutt? Look at me, look at me, EA. Look at me, look at me. You're out of your mind. You think a 14 day ban would stop me? A 14 year ban wouldn't stop me. My subscribers, my fan base is the greatest fan base to exist on YouTube. Facts. And I'll tell you why. I told the boys on Twitter, I said, boys, EA is trying to stop us. And everyone is pitching in right now to rebuild the WOM squad. Number one, Nick DeMeo just hooked me up and let me use his account, which is so clutch. Now, I'm not gonna lie. The team is gonna have to, like, you guys are gonna have to, like, live with me here. The team's gonna have to be a little bit ratchet. And I know that does suck, but some of the players from my old team either won't be on the auction house or are not gonna be attainable. For example, I had 98 Saquon Barkley, right? Well, the 98 Saquon Barkley, you could only get if you played on Madden 18 and got uh saquon's rookie card something like that so it's not really possible for me to get the saquon on this one so i'm gonna have to do a different halfback no matter what happens though it will be wheel of mutt it will be sick we're gonna win all three playoff games then we're gonna win the super bowl and i'm gonna rub all of it in ea's face because they cannot stop me i'm gonna finish assembling the squad we will come back here for this first episode in the playoffs and then that's it, boys. All right, boys, are you ready to bask in the glory of what we've reassembled? All right, check her out. Okay, so I need everybody to understand something before I hop in. I know this sucks, but EA is not going to win because if I sit here and just bitch the whole time about how my team kind of got screwed over, then EA wins. This is what they want. They want me to be upset. They want you guys to not like the series. They want us to lose, and we're not gonna lose. So I wrote this speech. His Wheel of Mutt squad is not determined by the players on his team. It is not determined by the overall he has made or even the amount of wins he has. For a man's Wheel of Mutt squad is determined by the blood, sweat, and tears given for each difficult game. It is determined by the attitude he brings each day by his ability to persevere and roll with the punches. So give that man hell, EA, and ban all his accounts. Douse him with your shitty gameplay and pair him up against only the cheesiest, most 99 overall god squads, because that man's spirit will never die. <laughs> He's very consistent. With that being said, Let's overview what the team looks like right now. You know what the team basically is right now? It's like uh, when Thanos snapped his fingers and there was only like some of the Avengers left. Like, yeah, it was pretty sick that we still had like Captain America and Iron Man, but we we're missing Spider-Man. We we're missing some of the cool guys. The things that we can't get back, we can't get Saquon Barkley back. So we got Philip Lindsay in here instead. I couldn't find the 92 Chris Carter. So I threw in Tyree Kill. I couldn't find 92 Gronk, so we actually got a 96 George Kittle, which is even better. Offensive line is totally different. I, I didn't even feel like replicating those players. They're kind of irrelevant, to be honest. Now, we also don't have some of the power-ups on some of these players. So, like, I got Bobby Wagner. He's not powered up. I got Telvin Smith. He's not powered up. 
We did get Von Miller. Oh no, I need Foyu Satalukan. I have to go get Foyu Satalukan. That's so important. Foyu Satalukan is only 14k. That's just incredible. Now, additionally, I don't have a lot of coins right now. I am working on getting more coins, but this is how I got banned in the first place was buying coins. So, uh, you know, maybe I should like chill out. Now, another kind of uh, big L is I can't get 99 Deion Sanders. So we have 90 Deion Sanders. To make up for that, I got 99 Aaron Donald instead of the 90 overall Aaron Donald. Got Khalil Mack still. I don't have Landon Collins, but I got Ed Reed instead. I don't have Micah Hyde, but I have Justin Simmons instead. So honestly, this team is, is like a slightly better. There are some spots that are definitely worse, um, but there are some spots that are definitely better. So I think my last team was an 89 overall, and this one's a 90. All right, boys, we've only got 250,000 coins. However, I think that'll be enough, hopefully. If I get some crazy like jackpot, then... I'll make 250,000 coins work. Not letting EA win. This is going to be sick still. So our first spin is going to be a pack of cards. You know what? Because I kind of did cheat and take this 99 Aaron Donald. So, okay. My actual Aaron Donald was a 90 overall. And I should have powered this down to a 90. But I just got pack a punch. So we're just going to keep this godly 99 Aaron Donald. So we just pack a bunch of Aaron Donalds. It's beautiful. The next spin, please. This is the playoffs. We'll give me something. <gasps> Team of the Week boss? Nope. Insanity pack. Okay, we get one insanity pack. We can choose two slots in the insanity pack, and we can only take one of the players. Okay. So I'm going to choose two slots. I'm going to choose bottom left and bottom right as my two slots. I can take one player out of those two slots. So bottom left is 85 Lawrence Taylor. Bottom right is a 95 right tackle. Let's go. So I got a 95 right tackle. Hopefully my man's is not super expensive. 95 right tackle and we got a 99 Aaron Donald. Well, this is an excellent first episode back. Challenge wheel. Tell me which, I have so much inspiration. I'm like, I'm pumped to play right now. Like this is what I needed to happen. Fullback touchdown. Yo, our fullback on this new, like, technically new series is, like, a 48 overall, like, bronze. Like, he's so shitty. All right, boys. Um, let's hop into this game. This is game one of the playoffs. So I need three wins to get to the Super Bowl, then the Super Bowl. What do you got, bitch? What do you got? I don't think that's my team. I think that's his team. It might be my team, though, because it's hard for me to tell. Yo, that was my team. Erlach or Sherman, I don't care what you have, bro. Philip Lindsay, entirely unguarded over there. So, not really sure why that is, but I'm just gonna hit George Kittle right in the middle of the field for eight yards. This is such a weird, he's using the corner that's on Philip Lindsay. Oh, I'm gonna scramble with Lamar Jackson. Are you kidding? Look at all this room. Dude, and these jerseys are sick. This is a cover two, I think. Oh, wow. Dude, he's really not covering the middle at all. George Kittle's gonna have a field day. First and 10. Okay, he got... That was so lucky. All right, you know what, my friend? You're gonna get one of those every once in a while. Okay, there's Odell. Now I RB right up the middle. Oh, wait, no, who is in it? Who's in at RB right now? Oh, it's John Kuhn? Bro, why are you in? All right. <laughs> I mean, it, it didn't really matter that it was him because that was a terrible throw, right? But that's okay. We're going to clamp on defense, get the ball back, and I'm gonna, I'm still going to win this game. Come on. Second and six. He does go with the run play, and I'm going to get to the outside tackle made by Chris Harris Jr. The 99 Chris Harris Jr. is like the replacement for our 99 Deion Sanders, basically. We got some underneath routes coming. I'm very ready for them. Okay, I'm here for this. He wants to do that right up. Oh, no, 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 no. I think that's open. Shit. Okay, he actually runs it, which is odd. But okay, totally clamped. Second and 12. Let's see what he wants. I've got both of these fully locked. Oh, let's go. Give me that shit. I haven't used Ryan Shazir in so long. Let's go. On the two yard line. Let's go, boss to the house! 99 boss to the house! Let's go! From the two yard line! Oh, I should almost, I'm not gonna, but I could almost have stopped on the one to get my fullback touchdown, but I just wanted that. Let's go! Ran five wide on the two yard line. That's bold. Ooh! 
big set, dude. Shazir's about to be the MVP, and we've never used him before. I'm pumped about that. Okay, crossers. This one is not open. Do it. Do it. Throw that shit. Fucking throw it! it. Let's go! Shazir with the second pick. I'm t I told you, bro, you're going to rage quit. I told you you're going to rage quit. Here it comes. Gonna hit Randy Moss on the slant route again, and there's 12 yards. He's running some weird defenses. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I'm not gonna go switching out my playbooks if he's not gonna make any good adjustments. Let's see if he... Okay, his controller froze. Odell's got it on his feet! Wait! Oh my god, I just voice cracked. I ruined that whole play. I vo Why did I voice... Why, bro? Why? Why did my voice have to crack? It was so good. What do we got next? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Oh, yeah. Toss it. Absolutely toss that shit. Oh, you lucky bastard. Let's go! Big hitter fumble. Full you side, Aluakon with the fumble reception. And there's my rage quit. I called it. Your cheeks. Let's go. It doesn't matter, boys. It doesn't matter how much EA wants to cuck us. We will do this shit. All right. I got one spin on the rage quit wheel for earning that rage quit right there. And then we're just going to hop right in. To the next one let's see it so we get a 92 overall on the team wheel that's actually sick gonna spin our wheel of all the nfl teams i get one 92 overall player from this nfl team definitely gonna want to grab like i don't know an offensive lineman or maybe a d tackle would be clutch we got the texans i don't know who the texans have so let's see 92 strong safety Ooh, cornerback bradley roby Get Bradley Roby oh instead. Oh, goodness. 95 speed on Roby? Yo. Yes, bro. 100% doing that. I could get JJ Watt actually too, but no, I'm gonna get that Roby. That Bradley Roby's clutch. Okay, 100%. Here we go. 50K, 92 overall cornerback from the Rage School Wheel, and now we got a 95 speed slot corner. Way better than Kendall Fuller. I'm actually gonna start Roby over here and put Dion at my slot, because that Roby is really good. Wow, that is such a good card. Ladies and gentlemen, that's it for this episode. We pack a punch Aaron Donald. We reset the team despite EA literally banning me. However, we're ready to go. We're 1-0 in the playoffs. We got to go 2-0 in the next episode, then 3-0, and then the Super Bowl. And that'll be it for Wheel em Up for this season. It's been a hell of a ride. I love you all for watching. Thank you for sticking with me. You guys are the best in the world. You know I love you. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.